Hello YouTube, Dr. Sola. So, we are in Ashishi. As you see, we are tidying up, we are finalizing. Let me show you what the temperature of this room is. 36 degrees. And the AC is on. So, these nine inverters are overwhelming this uh, one and a half horsepower air conditioner. It just cannot handle the heat in here. And something I might do is I'll open it and clean the fields and see if it will make a difference. So, let me do that. Um, as you can see, we are currently generating 5,350 watts. Our battery is down 35%. And the load on this one is 4 kilowatts. So 4 times 9, I think it's 36 kilowatts. 5 times 5.34. No, it doesn't add up because each inverter doesn't have quite have the same number of solar panels on it. So here, this is 2.6. 3.78 so the load dropped a little bit um 2.65 there's one of the slaves load is 4.11 oh, load is different on this one and this on this one and then this is 5.29 4.35 is what the load is 4.15 now um this one is 2.68, 4.27. This one, you can see, I can bend that low. And then this one is another master. This one is doing 3.91, 4.16. So 4.1699 is about 36 kilowatts is what the load is and we are not generating enough to compensate for the load so we're discharging the batteries so here we are so you see our pylon tech batteries they are on here is master c uh, master b and here is master a so one weird thing I noticed with the pylon type batteries that I never paid attention to before, I guess, is that these lights will just go off in the whole bank. And then they will come back on again by themselves. We did that on bank Master A, did it on Master B, then Master B then. Okay, so if anyone has had this experience, please kindly share. But our batteries seem to have balanced a little bit. We've done a 100% charge. What we're struggling with is the percentages on the BMS reading. So the, B, the percentage varies quite a bit. It's now 35%. We'll go all the way down to 25% before we shut down. So this is better. Before we had this really weird blinky blinky thing going on. And then it seems to be holding it uh, fairly well. You see, you just saw it, right? So, see, the state of, state of just went 80%, which makes no sense, right? But it's not 80%. We know state of charge is not 80%. We know state of charge is like in the 30 See, it just went 35%. So that's something we're experiencing that makes no sense to us. The state of charge just bounces all over the place. But right now it's at 35% and we are... Let me see. I think we might be discharging the batteries. I'm not sure. So if anyone knows why on the inverter, the battery state of charge uh, fluctuates as much as it does, let me know. I'll also send it to the engineers and ask them for the opinion. Once again, this is Dr. Sola coming to you from Asheshe in Ogun State.